added my book report on The Hollow City, which is a sequel to the book Miss Peregrine's Home for Cure with Children. It was written by Ransom Riggs. Ransom Riggs, oh, <clears throat> some interesting background about him is that he likes to tell stories using pictures and words. And um, he first started um, writing when he was very young and he went to Kenyon College to study literature. And the, the title Hollow City is referring to the hollow gas that overran London in the book. And they're also in the first book. Uh, two, you guys can just pass the mic. And then two readings of small passages that highlight a literary element is Irony, the bird once thought to have been Miss Peregrine, now stood before them as her brother, a hollow ghost. And that's like irony, because we thought the bird was a good person, but it's not. And then a hyperbole is this like little kid, because they're hungry, they said they're starving to death, but they weren't actually starving, they were hungry. And then um, two, three, oh wait, never mind. Then connections with the book is the Holocaust are like figuratively the Nazis because like back in that time. So like, yeah. And their leader's like Hitler, but it's not actually Hitler. Um, and then it relates to the real world because like some of the like, the target readers are teens and like some teens like are misunderstood like Jacob was because his parents thought he had a mental illness, but really he was just a peculiar person. You could see Holocaust, which is really rare. And um, I give this book a five star um, rating because it vividly describes what's going on and provides photos that help you further understand. And the target audience for this book would probably be like like older kids, like not young ones, because it'd be too scary for them. And that's about it.